Hey, orange one here. So, uh, let's, let's just get into it, huh? There's this group of zombies over here. Um, we're trying to fight some of them, but not all of them. And, um, we'll see how that goes. I also have some random clean water there. Don't ask why. I haven't got a good answer. <laughs> um, the dissolved devour is making me a bit nervous. I'm just gonna shoot him once. Yeah, he's he's uh, got full health there. How are you doing against him, though? I think you're okay. If I try and hit you, what do I get? Yeah, you seem to be just dandy as well. Well, dang. Uh, we're gonna need to help out our friend then, if these devourers are that strong. Um, I'll take care of this feral dude and then I'll start shooting them for him. Okay, one of them's pretty much down. I think they just died. And the other one is, uh, not too hurt. But maybe he's gonna get hurt soon? I don't know. I'll let, um, our friend do a little bit more against him. Okay, that... Okay, he's about to kill it. He, he, he'll get it probably in the next, yeah, turn. Yep, you guys can keep on attacking me, that's fine. Oh. Sproglodytes. They're annoying, man. How are you doing there, Harvey? I just reload. Um, sure, put that in the ammo pouch. Can I get the Jane out and just drop the gun? Yeah. They are annoying, those guys. Uh, go ahead and pick that up. And we'll get the gun back out. I don't think we're gonna need to do any more shots, though. Nice work. Very nice work there, Harvey. Uh, the Shambler is kind of concerning because they are acidic, I believe. Um, so I'll shoot the Shambler. Yeah. But I think that that's pretty good. I think we'll try and just make sure that the neighborhood's uh, secured, like do one more pass around here. Why are you going for the alligator, man? What are you doing? Okay, now you're surrounded by three fairly nasty enemies there, Harvey. Not a good look. Oh, there we go. There's now only two very powerful enemies. I'll get the hollow, though, for you. I think I have like 1,000 plus bullets, so there's no real reason for me to hoard it other than um, giving you experience. And how are you doing now? Yeah, you're still just fine, man. Honestly, if you have less than 10% damage, you're like not even hurt in my mind. I really want to give him repair nanobots. If I was able to get him to use those properly, legit, he would be unstoppable. Oh, you're bleeding? Uh, do I have any ba I do. Uh, hold on. Use bandage on the torso, yeah. Um, I will go ahead and dismember these while he's taking care of the, um, not acidic ones. And there's acidic ants around. Um, we should be cautious about that. That could be problematic for us. Oh, look, another solar uh, vehicle. Well, we definitely have enough solar panels now. That much is for sure. We just need to collect the stuff from here. You know, I saw um, someone on the Reddit said that you can haul vehicles now. So if I got like a truck or something and attach that to our current um, car, then that we could just load it up with like um, wood. So like this truck right here. 
I don't know. Does it have enough wheels? It does have enough wheels. So I think that I, I need to figure out how you haul a vehicle. But maybe I'll I'll load up like this. Uh... I think we might be able to load this up with like wood. I mean, we might be able to just drive it back, honestly. Like if I just put a little bit more gas in here, this vehicle we could probably drive back with like tons and tons and tons of wood and planks and pipes and I don't even know. I kind of need to make a little shopping list for myself, honestly, you know. How are we doing with the corpses? Yeah, I knew that there was some around here that we hadn't taken care of. Always is. It's hard to get them all right. And then there's that cr uh, the crawling. That's not the the one that I took out earlier, is it? I can't remember. It's all kind of blurred together, you know. But isn't that fun? Like taking out the zombies with your friend like that. Oh, there is more of them coming. They heard the noise. Are you nauseous right now? Uh, I'm gonna take that one out. Can I put my gas mask on? I don't like the putrid runs. They're really annoying. And one last put putrid, and then we're gonna need to reposition ourselves to get rid of the corrosive. Yeah. And that should be good, I think. And Harvey is gonna. He's kind of 2v1 there, that's not really fair. Yep. Uh, hazmat zombie, why don't you come with me? I'll just kind of walk you around while our friend takes care of the wrestler. <laughs> oh, not gonna go for the hazmat? Okay. Fine. Um. Oh. What was that? What did I just hear? Southwest and below. Uh, that's suspicious. To say the least. There's a lot of things down there. Whatever it is. Uh, that makes me nervous. Maybe we can kind of lure them up though. Or like, they'll, they'll start to kind of make their way up here, I think. Um, ignore. I feel like I'm the NPC right now. Like Harvey's the real celebrity. Uh, what is going on with your effects? What is that? Uh, badly poisoned in the head. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go get you that water that we brought over. Wherever we put it. It's right here, I think. And then, let's see, what was it? F. Okay. Now it's capital I. Okay. So you got some water, that's good. Um, unfortunately, I think he puked up the last water. <laughs> Can I siphon more? Yeah. I think that's all of it. Just gonna walk around with my water here as you get hydrated and hopefully you don't puke. I'm suffering from radiation sickness. Yeah, it's not acute radiation sickness though. Honestly, you're fine. You're just like, oh my gosh, no, you're not fine. What the heck? You got attacked by something that irradiated you pretty badly there. Yeah, if he gets like over a hundred, I think that's when he starts to have some negative side effects. Is this... This... I think that's the... Yeah, this is the booby-trapped one. This one could have explosives and all kinds of stuff in it. That's like the house that you'd never want to go in. Because it literally has landmines. And, oh, look, more fungus. 
What is that right there? Fungal clumps. Well, you know we have to at least start a fire here. Where is it? Yep, there we go. Is that smoke approaching us? Kind of feel like it might be, but I'm not sure. I'm just waiting a little bit to uh, watch that smoke. I think we're okay. Um, examine. Take that off. Honestly. I'm not too worried about that. Whatever it is, um, we can deal with it when we're done working on the car. Hello, Boomer. Come out of there. Yeah, we gotta we gotta keep an eye on Harvey. He's probably gonna be nauseous and have all kinds of issues because of that irradiation. I need to um, get some CVMs installed in him because if they do overload, overload, yeah, look, he just threw up there. So it's like not even worth um, beating him as of right now. Not unless we were to get him high first, because they actually changed it so marijuana will suppress um, an upset stomach. Nausea. I almost said an upset tummy, and I'm like, what, have, <laughs> what am I going on about? Um, does this have storage batteries? It does. Can I just, like, rip that thing out because we've got a super strong man yeah dude i love that we're gonna have so many solar panels and like um batteries installed in here can i let's see where needs a solar panel yeah i'm gonna stick the solar panels on first and um of course repair them then we'll work on upgrading them i know it's wasteful but hear me out, I just kind of want the electricity. Oh no, this needs solar cells. <sighs> I forgot about that, how they changed it. So you need to actually use, like, scrap parts to repair solar panels. Um, do I have the tools to disassemble a solar panel? It looks like I do not. Go ahead, drop that, it's fine. We'll do a little little work on the v wait, hold on. Um did I install that on a dumb place to install a solar panel? I did. Okay, well we'll move it. It's fine. <laughs> uh let's see. If it's smashing and it's right by my car, then sure. Nosh says, are you heart? Hurt? Yeah, I think Hervey, Harvey is hurt. I think we established that. Uh, if it starts smashing out there, then I will. Oh. Hold on. Something's out there. Something that's generating smoke. I don't know what I'm hitting. There's an Icarus, apparently, back there. I don't know. Apparently there's a demon behind us. But we haven't killed it. Maybe I should not be ramming it with my external tanks. That might be a bad idea. Um, it doesn't seem like he's really getting hurt from this. The dang Ekis. Uh, I'm slowing it down a little bit. Uh, oh, now we're smashing into the tree. Oh, there's the Ekis. Uh... I'm just gonna turn it a little bit. Man, this Ickus is taking a beating. Gotta hand it to them.
Can I just kind of wait there for a little bit? I think it might be dead. But I'm also not positive about that. No, it's not really dead. Man, this guy is so annoying. Hold on. Now I'm, I'm getting myself in a sticky situation because we're going to start... Seriously? I'm just stunning it. Okay, at least we got the fire, right? Is the fire... Yep, lit a fire. I'm getting a bonus now from that. That's nice. Okay, this... I, I don't know what to do. This We've been doing this for a while now. Let's just drive up and away just a little bit. Um... I'm going to just keep an eye on... See, yeah, the Ickis is kind of coming towards us. I think I'm going to just um, fall back just a little bit to do some of the work with the solar panel because the Ickis won't leave us alone. I think that's probably far enough, right? Um, man, really, a shambler. If I if I shoot him, the other zombies are gonna hear it. Why are you guys so hard to kill running over? Okay, there we go. They're dead. Okay, we just destroyed that Kevlar harness that I damaged earlier. <laughs> Whoops. Ignore the crash. Unless it's that Ickis. We just need to um, get that solar panel adjusted on the car. I mean, I think that's that house that's coming down, which will be interesting because that should actually attract zombies to that location. And so we should have a pretty cleared out city after that. Uh... Okay, so the stuff fell down. Can I take that solar panel? I'm going to remove that. Again, sorry that we're wasting in game time. I think it's best to remove that from the outside and we'll get it installed kind of in the front where we... I think there was three spots at least where I was like, wait, we don't have something over that? That seems a little silly. Yeah, like this right here. Get that installed there. I also want to get like a like a solar recharging station that we can haul around behind us. And then we'll have like a little mobile base that we can take with us, maybe with a couple extra seats for like our um for our little army of mutants, like our little bird man. He's been recovering so long though. I I don't know. If, that seems like too, way too long. It's like silly how long it's taken. Um, though with the solar cells, I think you can farm those. Like you can, uh, like do the iBots, have the iBots come fight you, you know? Uh, security system? No, I don't need that. I was wanting to get that storage battery installed. That'd be really nice if we could get that. I wonder if we ran over like solar cells. I kind of feel like we might have. Hey, the smoke's not there. The smoke monster's gone. When I said smoke monster, I got like a flashback to Lost. Oh no, I just destroyed bullets. Like I care though, right? <laughs> The mad bullets that we have. Uh, da, 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 da. Kind of want this and that. I'm not really worried too much about the clean water. 
And I'm just gonna close those so that the Ickus doesn't get us. And then, can I turn off the camera? We don't really need to be able to see outside right now. All we need to do is be able to see in here. And that means... Um, let's see, where could we put a ba uh, another battery in? Uh, don't we have a large storage battery? Or we got a storage battery here, but no... What? No glare protection? Really? We do. It's just, it must be not right there. What do you mean, no glare protection? I have welding goggles in here, don't I? What? Really? When did I take that, that out? I kind of don't believe that. That's kind of weird. Uh, safety goggles... I think we might be able to even make that, but the other stuff, <sighs> that's really annoying. Let's see, um, I'm just going to put it down here for now. We'll get installed, just not right now. Um, then can I kind of drive up and over? Yes, we can. Cool. And then I think the other solar car that I was looking at was that? Yes, it was right here. Cool. Our car will have a lot more power after this. I love having our cowman doing the work on, on the car with us. <laughs> so cool. Uh, a gasoline zombie. We should probably take care of that, huh? I think those guys can like start like really big fires if you're not careful. Um, corrosive dismember. It's fine. Uh, let's go over to this gasoline zombie. I just kind of want to check it out. I haven't seen one of these in a really long time. And if I hit you, are you going to explode? Okay, if there's fumes coming from its mouth, probably don't want to do anything with that. Um, you know what, Harvey? Get in the car. I'm going to kill the gasoline zombie. I just want to be um, careful. And I don't want him getting in the way. If I go over here, can I open that and get away? Come here. Keep on coming. Can I shoot you from here? I can. Yeah, see, he explodes into fire. Well, that house is gone. I hope there's nothing uh, of value there in there. Let's just have a quick glance. Um, there's nothing... Right there, right? No. Yeah, I don't think I even want to go in the house. I just be a little bit careful. Okay, there's this other solar thing though. Um I did see a couple zombies that were like wandering around over west here. Actually, is there I'm just curious. If I look at the food here, what do we have? Nothing. Uh, there's a little bit of stuff here. I'll take it. Chicken noodle soup. Sounds good. Yeah, I figured, you know, the companions, they... Uh, let's do a little looting, right? Why am I... I probably need to just... I'm probably rolling around with like a ton of weight of stuff, huh? Yeah, just give me a second. Catch a breath and unload some of this junk that we've been hoarding. Yeah, like the chainsaw I don't need or that fat. <laughs> I've been carrying around for like two episodes now. 
I don't need that magazine either. I kind of like having the Geiger counter. That's been moderately useful. You could use that permanent marker to vandalize things. Let's go vandalize things. Okay, team. Um, what do you vandalize something in the apocalypse as? Oh, I know what we're gonna do. Come on, come on out, Harvey. We're gonna we're gonna use this prominent marker to write on this car. Uh, the terrain, an item? No. Uh, never mind. We can't write on the car. Oh. Right, rare. Um. Right, you gotta, you gotta go with the classic. I don't know why I capitalized that H. That was weird. Um, so apparently we vandalized the ground underneath the wheel of the car, because Nosh is um, a very unique person. I'm hearing a lot of crashing. I think that's underground though, which I do kind of want to check out. You're gonna just charge in all three, three v one, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen, man. <laughs> kind of a dumb move. I'll take one of them off your back. And hopefully you get them. Yeah, come over here. Okay, maybe I, I do need to actually kill one. I'm not sure. That wrestler pretty much got killed by one of his attacks, but didn't actually get killed. Yeah, this is uh, is not going as well as I'd hope. There we go. Okay, you got a couple hits in there, right? There's a shocker brute. Where is it? That thing needs to die, like right now. Can I get a nice... yeah. I can kill that thing from here, and I'm I'm a happy camper. A choking sound. Oh, okay, that's kind of weird. Um, shambler. I think we're gonna ignore the shambler. There was a couple zombies that were like down over here around the shocker brute, right? Or no, those are giant wasps. Maybe I should have let uh, the Shocker fight the Giant Wasps. Well, too late now. Okay, we're, I have to check out the Wasp House, right? You have to. If you see a special uh, location like this, I think you have to. Check it out. It's the Cat Away, right? There's a lot of, a lot of weird walls in here, but not much else unique. Hey, uh, <laughs> I wonder if our companion wants some. Deal with his uh, pain. Ah, there's a giant angry red wasp. There we go. That was super easy for him. Kicks him. Nice. Good kick. Just can't catch my breath over here, don't mind me. Ah! It looks like he's able to reliably hit them. Can I eat anything? <laughs> Mustard. I'm not gonna eat that. That's just, that's just wrong. Just eating that. Dried rice. Sure. Not very much dried rice, but it's something. Better than nothing. I'm curious about the basement. Evening gown. Okay. Um, my grandfather once used one of those to... <laughs> as like a towel. Um, look, there's not a towel, as I said, towel. He used that as a towel once. <laughs> To clean his car and I, when he's sleep uh, walking, like not consciously, like my granny's like 
nightgown. Oh, never mind. Entrance is blocked. Is it just me or does that tile look a little weird underneath it? It's like different. If I try and smash um, down, it doesn't let me. Yeah, I feel like there was like wa uh, the wax or something that got in the way. I just literally just like punched down a wax wall and there was a wasp there. Great. Yeah, they. I think there's a room in here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. The wasp will blues. Um, homebrew or wasp adhesive. I think I'm gonna pick it up because I think you can actually easily turn that into a useful item. I don't think it takes very long to craft it or anything. Is what I mean. Thank you, Harvey. I knew you had me covered. Hence why I didn't even try and defend myself. Nothing in the ambulance for us. Okay. Um, Shambler. Take that. No, I don't want to step into the acid splatter. Wasn't there, there was that old solar car that we wanted to take the panels off. Okay, let's go do that. And um, we'll probably start the episode taking care of that. I need to look into the hauling and how it's gonna work, but I'll, I'll try and get that done in the next episode. If not, I'll just bring a ton of stuff back to our base. Uh, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.